This video is geared more towards the hobbyists, people like myself that collect real fire alarms and make videos of them. I feel like I shouldn't have to say this, but please do not tamper with fire alarms that are in real buildings. That is not okay. Alright, let's get to the video. This is a requested video from one of my fellow fire alarm hobbyists. They would like to know if they buy a simplex dual action pull station. Here's one right here. This is a simplex 299-9761. Can they convert it into a simplex single action pull station? Like this one. This is the same thing, except it does not have this dual action push part. The answer to that question is yes, you absolutely can convert these pull stations into single action and I'm going to go ahead and show you how you can do that. It's actually really simple. So all you have to do is take the simplex B key, open it up, and then on the inside you see these two black plastic pieces right here. All you have to do is take them, kind of squeeze them together, pop it out, and then this part's the trickiest, you just have to kind of force it through the cover. Kind of like that. Sorry about the truck in the background. And here it is. As you can see, the push part is now removed. And all you have to do is close up the pull station. And it is now single action. Yes, you do have these two holes in the background, but what you can do, if you want to get creative, you can cover it with like a red piece of paper or something like that to help make it not look as obvious. And of course you can convert the pull station back into dual action by sliding the black piece back up through the holes and then just reattaching it at the top. Just like that. And now it's converted back into dual action. Throughout this process just be careful because this is cheap plastic, it can break easily so just make sure you're being careful. There's definitely a few different models of this kind of pull station. As you can see, this one has a red back and this one has a silver back and it's pretty much the same thing. But they all generally work about the same way. And as for converting these into conventional, all you have to do is get down to the bare wires that go directly into the button and just use those as your circuit. So on this pull station, you might have to cut these wires and just use the wires that go to the button. And then if you want, you can unscrew these four screws here and take off this back plate. For the subscriber that requested this video, I hope it helped. If you have any video requests, please put them in the comments below and I will try my best to help you out if I have the time. Thank you for watching.